Good morning, Trailblazers. Today is Tuesday, August 29, 2017. I'm Park from Miss Molina's class. And I'm Blair from Miss McMahon's class. Everyone, please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Be seated. Now let's go to Ms. Gruber, our school counselor, for a few announcements. Good morning, everyone. Uh, it's time to get r down to those stars for this week. I'm very excited. My wheel is full, so I'm very happy. All right. Let's pick four. One, two, three, and an orange one again. Four. Ava Webster for Miss Shipman's class. Let's see. Colin Brazell from Miss Bellflower's class. Riley from Miss Dillon's class. And Nolan Atkinson from Miss Shipman's class. Come on down, guys. I'll be waiting for you. You're my star students for today. Back over to the news team. Today's lunch is Trayless Tuesday with teriyaki chicken and veggie brown rice, whole grain cheesy bread or chef salad with whole grain breadstick. Food is also available. Now let's go to Ms. Kettler and Dr. Poe for a few announcements. Good, Good morning, morning Trailblazers. Trailblazers. Happy, Happy Tuesday. Tuesday. Another nice morning out there. Very nice morning. Yep. You know, we've been enjoying a couple of mornings now. I think we better get ready. Yeah. It's too good to be true. <laughs> You're going to get another heat wave? Yeah, we're going to get another heat wave. <laughs> well, right about now, we're in a drought wave. Mm -hmm. We haven't had any birthdays. We're still in the drought, huh? Yeah, we're still in the drought. There are no birthdays ahead. today. Wait, when well, do we have birthdays coming? We have coming, birthdays. I think tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow. The 30th. The 30th. Yeah. Well, we'll look forward to we'll tomorrow. Look forward to then. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> All right, any other announcements? No other cool? announcements at this time. All right, we had a great first informational meeting for the patrols there yeah. are some patrols already <laughs> on duty so trailblazers if you're not a patrol i want you to make sure you are listening to the patrols mm -hmm. following their directions they are here for your safety so make sure that when they say please stop running in running the hall hallways. please go to your designated areas listen to their directions we've given them instructions to be respectful of you and we expect your respect back to them so okay. um, we just want everybody to be safe on campus and we need that extra help so thank you fifth graders mm -hmm. for stepping up to be our patrols all right tonight we have second grade curriculum night so we'll see you there at mm -hmm. six o'clock in the media center um, just a reminder there is no child care so make right. sure trailblazers you tell your parents they're gonna have to hold your little siblings in their laps or whatever <laughs> or get another sitter oh. at home we are not providing child care this um, this year all right those are all the announcements I have have a great Tuesday we're gonna sit on back to the news go back to Miss Grewer for a few recognitions Here they are, our star students for today. Okay, who's going to help me out with S? Okay, no. Stay safe. Fabulous. Who's going to help me out with T? Okay. Take charge of your learning. Fabulous. How about A? A for Ava. Act responsibly. And R, R for Riley. Respect yourselves and others. Fantastic, guys. Never let me down. Okay, Ava, what does your slip say today? Always on task, always being sweet. Ooh, that's a nice nomination. Who nominated you? Jasmine Shipman. Very nice, Ms. Shipman. All right. Nolan, how about yours? H helps other other student daily without being asked. Nice. And who nominated you? Ms. Shipman. All right. Two for four. All right, Riley, how about yours? Picking up Santa's without being asked. And who nominated you? Emily. Good job, Emily. All right, Colin, last but not least. Help Nathan Crane look for his lunchbox. And who nominated you? Miss Bellflower. Wow, I have a lot of S, T, A, and R today in these nominations. All right, well, you know what this means. You're going to get a Starbucks for the school store. Good job. And good job to all the nomina nominees that are nominators that nominated today. And you know what to do. 
find them, give them a pat on the back and a high five because they're your star students for today. Back over to the news team. Here's our Science Minute. Good morning. We are going to continue with our galaxy and space questions. Today, Science Minute is talking about NASA's four very important space telescopes. These are four of 93 other space telescopes circling the Earth. We'll start with NASA's Hubble Space Telescope, the granddaddy of space telescopes launched in 1990. It is the size of a large school bus. Just imagine the bus you take home and get to school. Every 97 minutes, Hubble completes a spin around the Earth, moving at the speed of about 5 miles per second, fast enough to travel across the United States in about 10 minutes. The Hubble views visible light. Another famous space telescope is the Chandra X-ray Observatory, which was launched in 1999. It is the most powerful X-ray telescope. It examines the X-rays coming from the quasars and black holes. The Spitzer Telescope was launched in 2003 and it uses infrared radiation to see far away galaxies, black holes, and even comets. And the fourth space telescope is the Kepler, which was launched in 2009. It is searching the Milky Way galaxies for exoplanets, which are planets outside our solar system. There is a space telescope twice the size of the Hubble called the James Webb Space Telescope that is due to launch in 2018. There is a reason we have all these telescopes in space. They are Earth's eyes and ears looking and listening to our universe. Pretty cool. And that's it for today's Science Minute. Our essential piece of success word for the week is citizenship. Citizenship is having the desire to help out in my community and also caring about others who live and work around me. I show good citizenship when I volunteer my time in a community or school. Of WDTS. Keep putting the pieces together for your success, Trailblazers. Bye.